What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Keandra, and I'm back with another video. And in today's video, I have a huge, 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 okay, it ain't that huge, but a huge nail haul for you guys. And as y'all can see, everything is on my bed. I've already opened all this stuff. Um, Hold on, I'm gonna adjust myself. But yeah, I've already, I've already opened most of this stuff that y'all seeing um and every single item came from amazon y'all i will have the direct links to everything that i bought in the description box below and make sure you like this video make sure you subscribe and drop me down a comment below anytime throughout the video you feel like you want to comment go ahead and drop that comment ain't nobody ain't nobody stopping you ain't nobody stopping you from dropping your comment so hold on y'all so i don't need my phone damn me away all right so before i get into the video i just want to say that um i really don't know if i'm gonna be an aspiring nail tech y'all i'm the type of person where when i feel like i want to stop paying money for a certain service and learning myself i'm gonna just do it so this was one of those moments it was random i had the money so i thought why not buy all the stuff that you need to get your to do your nails and figure it out yourself i just want to learn a new thing i'm gonna just learn it and i feel like i could do whatever i put my mind to everybody should think that way because it's true this was my first ever set and hold on y'all i feel like she definitely needs some practice laying at acrylic is not the easiest thing but what is when you learning something you know what i'm saying like sometimes stuff ain't gonna come easy but yeah i definitely need more practice but this was my first set using some of the items that i'm gonna be showing y'all in this haul so anyways that's enough talking i've been talking for a minute we're about to get into it the first thing that i'm gonna show y'all i'm sorry for the glare by the way i can't see without my glasses so y'all um another disclaimer some of this stuff is like out of its bag out of its place i like i said i didn't open the stuff been through the stuff so yeah but we're gonna start with this bag right here it is my uv lamp y'all there is so many of these on amazon that you could pick and choose from all of them are pretty i'm not gonna say all of them but they range from different prices and for the most part most of them are affordable but this is the one that i got it's a two-on-one led uv lamp and this is exactly what it looks like right here let me know if y'all want to see a video of me like my first ever nail set or whatever i do have a kiss one coming on the way using a kiss kit but this was not a kiss kit this was straight like not a kiss kit acrylic um mia secrets all that type of stuff so yeah but let me know if y'all want to see the video because i haven't did my other hand but anyways so this is what my um my lamp looks like i'm gonna open it up real quick so y'all can see i've already used it it works great um it doesn't have a screen or anything like that if you wanted that you definitely can find lamps around the same price as this one and i believe i want to say i paid 28 dollars for this lamp but that's what it looks like and it just has the on and off button the five seconds 30 seconds and 60 seconds and it is motion sense where you could just click it and then it comes with the cord right here that you plug into the wall or the extension cord whatever and yeah it works perfectly fine so moving on to the next bag that i see i got this what is it called tip cutter so it came in this packaging it came with extra little like metal things that thing right there it came with an extra one of those yeah it's just a pretty pink tip cutter to cut your nail tips and some of the stuff, like I said, it came different at all different times. So some things came along, some things came together. It kind of just depends on when stuff is supposed to come, if you're ordering off of Amazon. So in the same bag, I got my, it's like a cuticle pusher and they're basically cuticle tools. Like everything you need for your cuticles. And these are so pretty, y'all. Like, look at that. They holographic. And you can just push your cuticles back, scrape the cuticles, do all of that good stuff with these. So yeah, I got those. And then also in the same bag, I got some dapping dishes. Here is what it looks like. Y'all, these were like, I remember how much these were. They were like $5 or something. And it's just these two little, two little ones that came in this bubble wrap like this. 
so yeah they really small but whatever y'all i didn't feel like going on aliexpress and waiting like two months for my nail supplies so i just got everything off of amazon moving on in this little box right here um i got this which i'm so excited to try it's this glam and glitz um color blend acrylic and it's like that milky white color i'm really excited y'all love acrylic nails like more than gel but yeah it's just um in the shade milky white this was almost 20 dollars. it was like 16 or 17 bucks for this but i know glitz and glam is a good um brand for different colored acrylics like i said i'm going in no particular order so yeah this white shirt honey all right there we go next i got my brush um i decided to go with this panna brush um i believe this is a number eight yeah this is a number eight and so far i really really like it you can find it on amazon as well as everything else the little thing just came off it looks like just a number eight and it is a nice nail brush so yeah also got this cuticle oil which i believe you can find this at walmart as well if you don't want to go on amazon and purchase it it was like six or seven dollars but yeah it's just this milk and honey cuticle oil and it smells so good it smells like soap to me so yeah that's a lot of cuticle oil it should last me a minute i, I believe her channel is nails by vic i've been watching her she is bomb at these poly gel nails so she um inspired me to go ahead and purchase a poly gel kit and y'all haven't even opened this kit like everything else i've opened and i've seen it but as for this poly gel kit i have not opened it yet but if for those who don't know what poly gel is it's basically a blend between acrylic powder and gel polish so it's like a super thick consistency almost as if like i said that you took a gel polish and you took some acrylic and mixed it together but this is what the kit comes with it's by mccart and it comes with the clear the pink and the new poly gel it comes with a slip solution and then a top and base coat and then i see a nail filer i see the little brush and i see some nail forms and duo um forms but yeah i would definitely recommend this kit for beginners if you get into nails it's supposed to be a super easy convenient way to do your own nails at home and you do need the uv lamp so yeah i got this in that same box even though i stole it out that box i remember it coming in this one as well it's my mia secrets liquid liquid monomer y'all this was expensive for this little four ounce bottle i did not expect it to be this small but this is four ounces and i believe it was like 16 or 17 dollars and it came in this little bag but yeah this is just your liquid monomer this box i got my mia secrets nail prep now you don't have to use mia secrets products or anything like that like that these are just the basic of what you need to do your nails the acrylic liquid the powder as y'all all know and all that stuff so this is your nail prep it's the dehydrator and then the um the extra bond this is the no burn acid free primer you need to lay that acrylic down and it's supposed to you know make your set last so i got those two i also decided to get this model ones um gel nail kit and this basically has 16 um 16 colors and then it comes with a base and top coat but y'all when i say these colors are bomb like i swatched some of them these colors are the bomb i don't know why the camera is like washing them out but here's the up close you get the base and top coat if it will focus and then you get all these colors you get two glitters you get two um temperature like call, they call them like mood or temperature changing polishes you get your white your black your red just a lot of colors up in here y'all i'm gonna just give y'all up close on the freaking screen so y'all can see next we have these which are also by my cart I got a lot of McCart Model Ones and Mia Secrets. That's what y'all gonna hear throughout um, this video as far as brands go. I basically just have these little things right here. Now you can use these when you get ready to soak your nails off. And I also bought some um, cotton balls from Myers. You can get these from anywhere. Meyer, Walmart, Target, anywhere. But yeah, you just use these. You soak your nail in some acetone or the cotton ball which i purchased this from walmart um 
and then once you soak the cotton ball you put the cotton ball on your nail put this on and allow it to soak this soaks off um any gel polish acetone soaks off acrylic yuck your nails everything like that so yeah this just came with a set of um 20 is for your nails and toes so yeah i got fat when it comes time to take off the nails and then for nail designs and all of that good stuff and nail decor whatever you want to call it i got these little letters that i saw nails by vic use on her video again shout out to her because her videos are bomb um but yeah they just look like this and i believe it's different color ones in here so i'm gonna just open them up because i haven't opened these all the way but yep they come with gold they come with is that hollow yes that is hollow honey so gold a hollow a white a black and a silver what do they call it like all old english letters i don't know but i thought they was cute and i saw them in her video so i decided to pick them up I got this tweezer man tweezer which y'all so i'm actually editing this video and i realized that i said tweezer i think it was the tweezer and tweezer man clearly that's a nail cutter so just ignore me and ignore the fact that i keep saying tweezer because it's a nail cutter nail clipper whatever you want to call it nail clipper <laughs> which i already opened and it's just a straight edge one this is good for if you are trying to achieve like coffin nails or anything like that even though with the tips that I use, you really don't need to cut them into that shape. But yeah, they just help you um, get a straight edge cut, basically. Instead of like regular tweezers that have that curve on them. And these are some good tweezers, y'all. They was like $5, but they definitely worth it. I also got these glitters that I saw Nails by Vic use. Shout out to her. I'm giving credit where credit is due. She used this middle silver sparkly one for a glitter poly gel nail set that was super duper cute but i'm gonna just open these i haven't opened these either just to show y'all what the glitters look like but here's a purple oh that's so pretty it comes with purple a darker purple it comes with red the silver that i saw her use it's like a silver hollow which is super duper duper pretty it also comes with a black. Y'all, I can't wait to start experimenting and doing different things with my nails. It comes with this like dark pink color. And then it comes with a gold. These are so pretty. It comes with a green. And it also comes with this blue. And I'm excited, like I said, to play in those. And then what I'm super excited about is this um, rhinestones that I got. They came all together in this bag right here. I have them on my nails. Y'all, I love these rhinestones. If you're looking for some rhinestones to actually like pop and they don't look cheap and they don't like scratch off or anything like that, purchase these. Like, look at this. I can't, I can't make this up. So those are these, they came in a set. They were like 10, 28 or something like that, but they totally worked it. Um, you get this little container of like all the chunky different shapes and stuff like that. Um, there is like diamonds in here and all type of just different shapes up in here. Squares, diamonds, rectangles, um, teardrop looking shapes. And then you also get the ones that are on my nails, which is a whole bunch of these circle ones that come in super tiny and then they come big so like they have a whole bunch of different sizes which i'm just in love with these rhinestones they also came with this um black tweezer in here that and then it comes with your white wax stick which helps you um pick the rhinestones up so all that came in that little set like together definitely 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 100 percent 10 out of 10 recommend these um rhinestones so that was everything in that one package oh and i almost forgot my nail files so um like i said i watch nails by vic for like the freaking fifth time um like i said i'm giving credit where credit is due but she recommends like a curve nail file um and even though she got different ones i just got the ones by my cart and these are 100 by 180 grit so it's a little bit finer on one side and a little bit more rough on the other side but yeah these work really nice and um helping you to achieve achieve like your um your shape when you're doing your nails 
and as well as filing down any um, acrylic and stuff like that so these are my nail tips she also i believe recommended these tips um they just some um, stiletto tips they really long i'm actually going to show you guys how they look because i had some laid out for when i was ready to do my second hand but um they just look like this it's just a clear um little curved tip but they actually straight tips like they don't have any curve or anything to them and guys they're actually very like bendy they're not very thick um just to let y'all know because when i put them out, i was like whoa like when i was dealing with the kiss kit um the kiss kit tips they were like thicker and stuff like that but these are really thin and they're clear i really really like these tips and they're really easy for if you want to cut um cut them into if you're trying to achieve what is the freaking thing called coffin all you have to do is use a tip cutter and cut the top off and then you basically have coffin so i really like those tips they come in like different sizes and stuff like that and they were fairly affordable and you get a lot in here so next i got these nail buffers which are essential in my opinion i mean it's essential i know you can use like the fine part of the um nail file but anyways i like this it's a buffing block and it's pretty coarse it's the purple ones and these just buff your nails out um i think this was a set of 10 and they also come with whatever these little things are but yeah i just got those next this one isn't open i think i just got this yesterday y'all i've been ordering stuff for like weeks but i have amazon prime so everything comes in one or two days and just just love it but oh yes i got these butterflies y'all they so freaking pretty it's so many different butterfly sheets um and i believe like to use these you cut them you cut the piece out you want to use and then you soak it in water or something like that but they're just little nail decals and they so freaking cute like when i saw these i was like oh yes gotta get them but they just look like this there's so many different types of butterflies flowers you can get like full butterfly nails if you want to yeah just a whole bunch of cute butterflies and different colors and stuff like that so i'm excited to use these moving right along i have this is this model ones yep this is model ones matte gel top coat so since i had the base coat i actually i actually ended up buying a base and top coat because that was before i decided to buy this um this little gel kit so i have like two top coats two base coats and i wanted to go ahead and purchase a matte um top coat because i never had matte nails and i don't know i just probably figured i would want to try it so this is my clear mia secrets um acrylic powder that i use to achieve this set right here um but yeah it's right here it's just some clear regular old clear acrylic powder by mia secrets though so that's why i was a little expensive but whatever <laughs> moving right along Oh, I'm excited about these, y'all. So, I got these really, really pretty butterfly, like, holographic little pieces. I don't know what you call it. Um, sequence. Because that's what they calling it. So, we just gonna call it sequence then. Oh, they so pretty. This is what they look like. It's so many different colors. You got red, orange, yellow, um, pinks. You got hollows, whites. All type of different ones. And then this is the second one comes with so many different colors but these are all butterflies so yeah super duper cute here is also like i said my base and my top coat that i purchased um separately and these are no white by model ones okay now we finally got one that's not open oh i just bought this like two days ago and here it is this is some clear nail gel resin for like crystals and stuff like that believe it or not for these since i didn't have um what is it called like a crystal adhesive like i know my um my ex nail tech or whatever she used to use this ib builder gel or whatever and she would paint it on my nail and put the put the rhinestones on but believe it or not for this i only used the model one's top coat that came inside of this kit i just laid one layer of top coat i put all my rhinestones on i cured it and then that was it i didn't even put a coat on top and it's been what two days and they've been okay and i did that for all the other little diamonds as well the ones that y'all see on my other nails all i used was top coat so i wanted to test out something that was actually meant for 
um, land crystals and see how this works. But I am going to like see how long the top coat along goes. But yeah, it's just this Mia, of course, Mia Secret Clear Nail Gel Resin. And it says it's a crystal adhesive. So we're going to see how that works. This was like $8 or $7. So next. Um, oh yeah, these are lint-free nail wipes. So I like to use these along with, it also came with this little bottle right here. As y'all can see, I just have 70%, I believe. It's some alcohol I got from Walgreens. This is all they had. So I bought the 70% one, but I put some of this in there. This is one of those nozzles where you just press, 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 and, um, it gives out product on um, these little nail free, I mean nail free, lint free wipes. So they look like this. They leave no lint or anything and you can just take um, take the little thing, pump some alcohol on it and then just clean off your whole entire nail. So yeah, I believe it's like a thousand or something like that in here. And like I said, this came inside of there as well. Okay, next I have some dotting tools in case I want to do some different designs or something like that. They're double-ended and there's a lot in here. You can create big dots, small dots, um, different designs. You don't even have to necessarily use a dotting tool just for dots. So yeah, they're actually really pretty though. And they just super duper clear with this little swirly design in them. And this one's like really small. But yeah. These super duper cute flame foil looking things. Um, let me open them up and show y'all how they look. That reminds me, I forgot to get some nail foil. Y'all, I'll be um, trying to go all out. Like, let me just chill and practice with my little basic sets first. But um, yeah, these are just like nail stickers. And as y'all can see, this one's hollow, but it's a different flames. I don't know if y'all can see, but. They just have different color like nail flames i thought these were really cool so i got them and they just have a whole bunch of different colors and sheets and yeah it's so many different colors but these are all flames which i'm super excited to play around with these too and stuff be falling behind nail glue fell behind my bed anyway this is my nail drill now just like the uv lamps they have a whole bunch of different nail drills that range from 20 and 30 something dollars all the way up until like 70 dollars but i just got this one by melody Susie, and it's actually a handheld one so it doesn't have a big base or a pedal or anything anything like that um it was only 26 bucks and it's a handheld one and but you just plug this one up it came with your different um nail bits and your sanding bands and then it came with this cord that you plug in and then here's the drill so it's super convenient just a handheld drill and then the little dial is actually on the plug um you can switch it to r or f for counterclockwise and clockwise and then you can control the nail speed also on here so yeah and then it also did come with extra sanding bands because y'all know you're gonna go through those a lot. So yeah, but your girl, didn't, she don't need all that fancy stuff and all that. I'm just trying to do my nails. I'm not even trying to, like I said, I don't know if I'm necessarily gonna be an inspiring nail tech. I just wanna do my own nails at home because I'm tired of paying people $70 per set. So yeah, I feel like I can do it myself, why not? Not to say I'll never go in another nail shop, but for the most part, your girl gonna be doing her nails at home and saving money, okay? Oh yeah, and here was my KDS nail glue. I'm finna try to get it for y'all. And of course, they fall all out the bag. We just love that. I can at least get one of them. <laughs> they literally fell out this bag. I believe it was like five or six, a five pack. So this is that KDS nail glue. This is one of the best nail glues, at least I've heard. Um, from other people on YouTube. So this is the nail glue that I bought. And like I said, it came in here with a pack of five. They just fell all behind my bed. So yeah, hopefully I'm not missing nothing. That was everything that I bought from Amazon. 
and all together y'all i want to say i spent roughly 200 plus dollars i think once you add everything up yeah stuff which is not bad at all because imagine how many sets i can get out of all this stuff so really about it i'm so happy i got this out the way because this stuff has been sitting in my room for like a week or two because i was waiting to do the haul before i put everything up so yeah like i mentioned before everything's on amazon pretty affordable for the most part and yeah these were just some of the basic things you can purchase off of amazon if you want to start um your nail business if you just want to do your own nails at home yada 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 so yeah make sure you like comment and subscribe um for more videos of me and i do plan on doing nail videos your girl just gonna keep practicing for my first set though this is not like i'm not mad at it you know what i'm saying i'm not mad at this for my first set so yeah stay tuned for future videos of me with nails we do nails on this channel we do hair we do clothing which i have a haul to do yeah like i said if you like this video make sure you like comment and subscribe and i will see y'all in my next video Never ask what you love, be a good phone when you don't Never ever ask what you show me some love, kiss me some hug